Okay, hi, it's Jason at Golf Principles here in Basingstoke, and I just want to put a video out there to clarify a couple of things that I've seen out on the internet. I've seen guys posting on YouTube about shafts and stuff like that. And you know, for the best intentions, they're trying to get across a point, and I understand what they're trying to do, but let me just set a couple of things straight. In the shaft, there are three kind of things that I would look for. I'm not saying it's perfect, but I would look for. First things first is what weight you can swing, okay? Light, medium or heavy weight. Very simple, very easy concept. I've done it before, I spoke about it before. A light weight, a middle weight and a heavy weight shaft, right? Once you understand which one of those weights suits you, then where is the weight? Okay, this is the one I'm gonna talk about now. Where is the weight? These two shafts, Project X70 and a Diamond Gold Taurus U X7, they both weigh about the same weight, 130 grams, 131 grams. Right? They're both very, very strong in the tip. They're both big boy shafts. One's got the weight up here. One's got more of the weight down here, i.e. Diamond Gold. They're very different in how they swing and how they feel. That physical in-motion feel, one will feel good and one will feel bad. There's also a third, which is the weight in the middle. But I'm doing this for pure demonstration purposes. Weight up the top, weight down the bottom. One of those is going to work. Now, I've seen some videos about what flex should I use? And I'll give you a real simple idea here. Either use the softest flex you can control or the stiffest shaft you can load. Now, Greg Norman was always adamant to use the stiffest shaft that you could control or create speed with, I should say. The control with the softest shaft, personally, I would always go slightly softer because you don't want to swing it all the way, all in, every single time. So I'm in the school where it says, if you're between flexes, just a fraction softer would work. But to me, being weight sensitive is, is far more important than flex, actually. You get guys who hit regular and stiffs, or stiff and X's, and sometimes they just can't feel a difference because there's not a lot of difference in the weight, right? So the weight is very, very similar, so they feel very, very similar. Surprise, not really. So that's where you would have to advocate and say, look, I think the way you swing it, the way you load it, you might want a little stronger shaft. I would probably hard step the stiffs, or if you like a little bit more stability, soft step the X's. This is where the expertise and the, if you like, miles on the clock come in and say, look, the way you swing it, I would go down this road. But if you're in doubt, always, always veer slightly softer because then you can control it and you haven't got to feel you've got to load the shafts so hard. Remember, a shaft is a vehicle for transfer of energy. So think of it like a bow and arrow. Look, you're trying to create energy and unload it. You're trying to snap it out. If it's stiffer, that takes more energy to create that, if you like, in front bang type idea. Look, see that? I'm pulling that quite hard. A softer shaft would need less energy. So I'm 50, I'm not gonna swing it that quick. I need something a little bit softer. I have to realize that. I have to wake up and go, oh, maybe today's the day that I have to go a little softer. It happens to all of us, okay? So it's the circle of life. When you get stronger and you're younger and stronger, you go stiffer, you get older, you drop down in flexes. But key also, you might feel that dropping down in weight will create a bit more speed or going up in weight will create more stability. It's a huge topic, but I just want to put it out there because it's something where people get in a minefield about what shaft to use and what flex to use. Think of it completely differently. Think about the weight, where the weight is, and how you create that energy flow through the ball. Just one to think about.